Okay, what is the wavelength of the photon associated with an electron transition from two to three? So this guy's moving up in the world, right? So here's our, you know, here's our nucleus. Here's our first orbital, our second orbital, our third orbital, right? So this, this thing is moving up, right? So the other way it can do that is that the photon is actually hitting the electron and making it pop up into that upper orbital. So this is an absorbed photon. Okay, it's absorbed in itself. And then all we have to do is figure out the, um, the wavelength of that. So the energy of the um, second orbital is minus 13.6 EV over 2 squared. Minus 13.6 divided by 2 squared is minus 3.4. I don't think I'd memorize this. And then the energy of the third is minus 13.6. EV over 3 squared divided by 3 squared and that is uh, minus 1.51 repeating EV, right? And then the difference between those is 1.8888 so the change, if I subtract those guys, right? The change is 1.8 repeating EV, right? And then we're going to turn that into joules. All right, times 1.602 E minus uh, 19. And that is 3, 3.026 times 10 to the minus 19th joules. And then we're going to figure out the uh, what the wavelength. Wavelength is HC over E. 626, six. that's a 6, times 10 to the minus 34, 3e8 over 3.026 times 10 to the teenth joules. All right, here we go. So fire away your 6.626, 34 times 3. E8 divided by the answer I just got. And I'm getting 6. 6.569 times 10 to the minus 7th, which would be 6, I'll say 657 times 10 to the minus 9th meters, which is 657 nanometers. Yeah, do, 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 do.